Okay, here we go. It's starting. I will shut up. Please note, due to COVID-19, release dates for other information presented in this video are subject to change. Okay, so this is the splash that's been, always been appearing ever since COVID-19 has happened. All right, here we go. Turn it out just a tad. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is the monster. This is Monster Hunter. Yep, here we go. I think, yeah, this is Monster Hunter. Wow, it looks pretty good. Although it could be CG. Yeah, this is CG definitely. Just based on looking at it, on it, of it. It could be. I don't know. Yep, here we go. Monster Hunter Rise and Shine. Capcom presents. Yep, there's the grappling hook that was supposedly uh, being discussed. Yeah, you can climb pretty much anything. Looks pretty cool. I just got an important letter. It looks like we've got a rampage on our hands. Uh oh. Ooh, uh it's very uh, Japanese inspired. Just like the prior portable games, like on PSP and such. Echo something. I probably pronounced that mistakenly, so my bad. Tetranodon. Great Izuchi. With <laughs> that monster is known as Magnum Malo. Magnum Malo. Hey, it looks pretty good for a Switch game. Interesting that they start off with this. I wonder if they'll have something else in the end. That hi that's very, very hype. Monster Hunter, rise, rise and shine. Shall we go? Coming March 26, 2021. Okay, that was the rumored release date. Oh, deluxe edition. Pre order to receive these bonus items. I love that you can ride on a doggo. <laughs> You can play the latest installment in the Monster Hunter series wherever you are and however you'd like. We've prepared a trailer for another title, so please take a look. Oh, this must be Monster Hunter Stories 2. That was also rumored. Yep. Okay. This seems like it. Capcom presents. Boy, Capcom support for the Switch. Oh, I look like Majora's Mask. The mask that they're wearing. A little bit. It's the eyes. But, uh, yeah. It's no mere coincidence but as I was saying, the Capcom support for Switch has turned around. This is destiny. Looks really nice. I like the cell shaded art style. I'm glad. Still alive. I thought I'd never see you again. I wonder how long this is supposed to be. I mean, it's since it's a mini, it can't be no more than 20 minutes, one would assume. Hey, hey Creative Rock, I hope you're doing well. Thank you for watching with me, I appreciate it. If I disappear, it's cause of work. I completely 100% understand. No worries. You can always watch later on Twitch or on my YouTube channel, at JLegend. And also on here on Twitch, at JLegendTW. Monster Hunter Stories 2, Wings of Ruin. Looks really nice. Like I said, I really like that art style. Summer 2021. That makes sense. 
Hello, everyone. Welcome to our third Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. What you've just seen is a first look at Monster Hunter Rise and Monster Hunter Stories 2 Wings of Ruin. Stay tuned for Monster Hunter Direct after this presentation, which will provide oh. an in-depth look at both games. Okay, cool. This Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase presentation will deliver the latest information about upcoming Nintendo Switch games from our development and publishing. Oh, I like the art for that. Yeah, I agree. Series will be released this year. Like, I think it looks right, great, better than a. Uh, Rise, but that's just me. To the rhythm with boxing exercises. Oh, okay. I remember this game. The sequel to Fitness Boxing, where you can enjoy working out to the beat. Oh, is this a sequel? Oh, okay. System. Fitness Boxing 2. Okay. Grab your Joy -Con I know this sold really, really well in Japan. One, Did the original came Select in America? I can't remember. Courses. Then get to it with boxing exercises. Customize your instructor's outfit to provide even more variety for your workouts. I would fail so hard at this. I have no rhythm. Are in I this lack song, the rhythm. Including a two-player mode, an alarm function, and the ability to turn off boxing moves. Save data also carries over from the previous yes, game. Yes, fun. So use all these features to help. Although, if there's any exercising game I want to try at this point, it's Ring Fit Adventure. And looks more of something up my ones. alley because it's an RPG. Janice, I'd get this. Hero and Karen. Karen. Oh no, not Karen. Is she gonna come up and tell you to take your mask off because it's it's impending, uh, it's intruding on your freedoms? Fitness Boxing 2 Rhythm and Exercise launches on Nintendo Switch December 4th. Pre-orders begin later today. An all new Disgaea game is here, dude! What? <laughs> Yeah, Prinny the Penguin says, dude. Oh, Disguise 6, okay. I never played any of these games. They always seem like too hardcore for me. A zany brand new installment of Disgaea is coming to the Nintendo Switch system. Meet Zed, the protagonist of Disgaea 6. But he's not just some lowly zombie. As a result, this is still a, uh, a strategy RPG stronger, the more he with an isometric overhead view. I would imagine. Personality also make their appearance in colossal showdowns. The beloved over-the-top battle system makes a triumphant there's return. My, there's Prinny, my dude. And now, max damage is in okay, the yeah, it's still it's still an isometric 2D level is strategy RPG. Million. Jeez, look at all those nines. Worlds and face off against the strongest it's over nine... <laughs> No. Get ready for an experience. Obvious joke is obvious. Common sense, genre, and destiny. This guy is six. Defiance of Destiny is coming exclusively to Nintendo Switch. Exclusively. Oh wow. So no PS4 version Plus, as well. Previous title, or PS5. Five. five complete will be free to play for a limited time in a special game That's... trial event exclusively huh. for Nintendo Switch. I would not expect members. that. Defend your turf in a ruthless criminal underworld. What's this game? Oh, yes, that's that John Rom not John Romero. But yeah, this is a uh, the mafia overhead 2D role playing slash strategy game. I can't remember the name of it off the top of my head. This was announced at a E3 uh, Nintendo event a year or so ago. Something Empire? I don't know. I think Empire was part of the name. I can't remember. Or Sin City? I don't know. Ooh, Roaring Twenties? That seems to be the case. This looks interesting. Yeah, there's Al Capone. Empire of Sin. I think that's what the name of the title is called. Yes, Empire of Sin. Okay, there you go. Yeah, this has been cooking up for a couple years, at least. A terrifying threat draws near in this tactical shooter. Rebellion. We closed the trap on Hitler's North Africa campaign. But what next? I'm headed for San Salini. Oh, is this like Sniper Elite or something? I don't know. Sniper Warrior or something? Is General Tobias Schmidt. Ought to be a straightforward mission, with no surprises. What could be easier?
I mean, I only said it because the guy was wielding a sniper rifle. Okay, we're about 10 minutes into the stream so far. Sniper Elite 4. Okay. Holiday 2020. Here's a quick look at what else is coming to Nintendo Switch this month. Oh, this month. Okay. It's a little too quiet in the long dark. So this probably this is probably almost over. Probably have one more announcement left. Game. We'll see. You're on your own as you journey through a frozen wilderness in the aftermath of a geomagnetic disaster. A chilling narrative awaits in the winter mute story mode. Or enjoy hours of permadeath survival gameplay. Experience true survival on Nintendo Switch later today. The fairway is open in PGA Tour 2K21. <laughs> I actually like golf games a lot. Where's Where's Mario Golf? That should be something that'd be coming up or shown hopefully soon. A physical version of this game swings onto Nintendo Switch September 25th. Defy the God of the Dead. Hades. Okay. Greek mythology inspired dungeon crawler. Thousands of story events and ability combinations ensure a unique experience each time you hack and slash your way out of the underworld, wielding the powers of mythical weapons of Olympus to aid in your escape. Hades comes to Nintendo Switch later today. Dive into the oh, yes. Yeah. This was made by uh, the creator of Sonic the Hedgehog, I think, and Knights. Welcome to Wonderworld. Leo and Emma were led here by the mysterious maestro, Balin. Okay, maybe this is not almost over like I was expecting. like stages, including an ocean stage, a wind stage, and more. As Leo and Emma, you'll don costumes to wield a variety of abilities. Ride the wind to float in the air. I would play this, maybe? To destroy giant blocks. I never played Knights, but oh, this is not similar to Knights. To find. But I like 3D platformers. Maybe, maybe if uh, it comes out and... Were, uh, the word of mouth is pretty good. Wait at the end of each stage. You can also pass a Joy-Con controller to a friend in a co-op mode. Combine your abilities and navigate through stages together. Oh, cool, there's co-op. Balan is waiting for you. Balan Wonderworld will make its grand entrance on Nintendo Switch Spring 2021. Oh, Room Factor life, Five. Okay, Crater Rock. You're gonna you're, you're gonna like this game. Build a new life Check it out. The grand I thought I saw Sonic for a second. Yeah, it's made by the creator of Sonic the Hedgehog, I believe. But yeah, check this out, Creative Rock. This is this game will be right up your alley, I believe. As a young man or woman with no memories, you'll get a fresh start in the rural town of Rigbarth as a peacekeeping ranger. In addition to protecting the town. Your day-to-day -day will include harvesting crops and fishing in the river. You may even find a special someone to start dating. A special someone. And get married. A new battle system allows you to perform combo attacks with allies to take down monsters. I love the art. Yes. Oh my god, that sheep is cute. <laughs> Available 2021. All right. This oh. next title will be our last. Oh, announcement. it's the last one. Oh, what is it? What is it? Is it Bravely Default 2? No, this is something else. Oh, Moon Studios. Oh, Ori and the Will of the Wisps. So that's coming out. Okay. Cool. Yep, I'm in. I'll <laughs> my ass off. Cool. Very cool. I still need to f finish Ori and the Blind Forest. <laughs> I started that on uh, the Xbox Game Pass service on PC, but I never got back to it. Very cool. Still no Bravely Default 2 though, unfortunately. That's probably going to be pushed back until next year at this rate. 
Ori, Ori, I need to finish the first one. Yes, me too. Ori and the Will of the Wisps. Available later today. Wow, that's much sooner than I expected. Ooh, is that a physical uh, edition? I think. Ori Collector's Edition. Oh, does it come with one, both one and two? Ooh, that looks beautiful, actually. Oh, that's why I am 8-Bit was there. I was like, they don't publish games, do they? That's all for today's Nintendo okay. Direct Mini Partner Showcase. That was